Hello everyone, this is Matt and welcome to the 12th part of my Quake Brillis Gem playthrough. Today I'm going to be playing through... Give me a change, Mr. M, but Mr. M. So, let's get going and see what's in store for us today. Okay, Quake title music. Yeah, seems a little bit more action focused. Quite a few monsters in this one. Which is cool. Interesting look. Okay. Not sure what that did, but I'm gonna... I'm building you about it, something important. Interesting design so far. What's this? Huh, that's weird. Some nice beveled corners in this one. Yeah, not the very exciting gameplay right there, but we do what we can. I need the silver key for that. Okay. Fancy lift. Interesting contours to this. Same with that. Pretty interesting. Oh, wait. Yeah, I meant to press F6. Yeah, this is a little bit weird. Not like in a bad way, it's just kind of cramped and a little weird. Did I know where I land here? Yeah. And I'm out of shells. Pretty unusual. Okay, what are we looking at here? Ogres. I'm not gonna camp them like I did in that last one. Yeah, we got all the grenades falling on that one that night. Okay, anything back here? No, not really. Oh, we have like six ogres here. No wonder it kind of felt like it was very loud. Oh, and, and on the other hand, it's neat because you get to hear all of all of Quake's theme. Usually, you're just gonna listen to the first couple of notes or something. Pretty interesting looking architecture in this one. Yeah, I hear that. Oh yeah, I forgot I have no shells. Yeah, now I have plenty of them. Yeah, we have quite a few monsters in here. What do we have in here? A bunch of scrags. Yeah. Hmm. 
Yeah, I see you up there. Come down here, please. And there is the first loop. Should probably stop trying to... Oh, that's a dog. I thought it was a weapon. Somehow. We have some enforcers up there, I think. Yeah, this seems a little odd. Is this water? It sure is a lot of rockfish. Yeah, the rockfish one. Those monsters you barely see any. You really don't see them getting a lot of views. Oh, we have zombies as well. Yeah, that should help my problems at least a little bit. Yeah, I jumped in here thinking I would see, like, a solution to my problems, but no, not quite. Yeah, that was about to happen. Yeah, let's just run away for a little bit. Ah, I see. Yeah, I get it now. I have to cross this bridge. to do that get myself a nice perforator or super nail gun unlock the bridge buttons and from there we should be mostly set I think yeah pretty interesting map There we go. Should be almost done here, I think. Yeah. I am I don't have a couple more grenades still. And I missed my shots. Oh. It's gonna be one of those maps, huh? At least we can do that to take care of those guys. Okay, I am officially out of ammo.
Yeah, that's afraid. I was that's what I was afraid would happen. Is there really no ammo around here? Yeah, I started to get the feeling these masks weren't quite as well tested as I thought they were. Is there any point to this? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna backtrack a little. Because there are some goodies I left back here. Maybe that's why it's feeling... Well, that's why it's feeling kind of unbalanced. Interesting little room here. And this would have been quite helpful when I was, you know, back there. But here I'm not sure I'm going to be able to make use of much of this at all. I'm saved by the gun. At least I got rid of some of the zombies. Um, backtracking just to make sure there are no more grenades. I think we're done here. But also because I'm gonna... I forget how I haven't really taken the screenshot just yet. Or the thumbnail. Yeah, let's go with this. I think this is a good spot. Looks pretty good too. Yeah, uh, it's not unbalanced, it's just really quite tight in ammo. Which might make it feel unbalanced, but it's not really quite the case, I would say. Still, interesting map. Definitely plays closer to what we, what we would expect from Quake. I don't have any problems with that. Yeah, so that was QBG, QBJ, Mr. M. Not sure if I actually said as QBJ or QBG in the intro, but yeah. Now we know. But yeah, it's right here. Yeah, it's a pretty cool map. It's certainly a little bit done with ammo, but then again, I suppose not. Uh, I suppose some maps are just gonna be that way. But yeah, like usual. This has met. Thank you very much for watching, and join me in the next video in which I'll be playing through Grayscale Downfall. So, yeah, see you there.